Seen as one of the greatest minds to have ever lived as well as one of the greatest scientific pioneers during the golden age of scientific enlightenment was that of Albert Einstein and his revelations surrounding the understanding of the very fabric of our reality. These discoveries are still only now being proven in the modern day and have left the scientific world in a state far more advanced than before his introductions to these strange concepts. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be highlighting these incredible scientific discoveries to help showcase the true genius of Albert Einstein. The Existence of Black Holes Only recently being proven in the modern day is that of the groundbreaking theory that Einstein provided when speaking on his theory of relativity and the warping of space-time that centered around the possible existence of a gravity well so great that it could cause even light itself to become trapped inside. This gravitational well was known, mathematically, as the existence of a singularity within space-time that would create an infinitely dense object within an infinitesimal point in space-time. This meant, essentially, that if enough mass and energy had become concentrated and fallen into itself, completely imploding due to the weight of the materials and the gravitational forces surrounding it, the object could theoretically stretch down space-time similar to that of an infinitely heavy bowling ball, bringing down a blanket that can stretch infinitely. At first, many scientists completely disputed the claim, believing that no such forces could exist within the universe and claiming that such a warping of space-time would alter causality itself and destroy one of the most basic laws of physics, as well as the fact that no such object of infinite mass and density within an infinitesimal point made any logical sense. Despite these claims and beliefs, Einstein stuck with his maths and his theories and argued that they must exist whether or not anyone truly believed it was possible. Albert Einstein's theories surrounding the existence of such an object would later be proven true on the 10th of April of 2019, after a number of scientists came together to compile all of the data received across numerous radio telescopes to create a comprehensive image spanning light years in every direction surrounding that of a black hole sighting. The image of the black hole not only helps to confirm Albert Einstein's pre-existing theories surrounding the existence of the singularity, but proves to be among one of the largest compiled pictures of the universe that was pieced together from a collection of rendered images from other radio telescope information. The Light Cone Causality One of the most incredible breakthrough discoveries that Albert Einstein made during the golden age of enlightenment of the scientific field of back in the early 1900s was that of his revelations on the nature of causality in physics. In classical physics, it is believed that an effect must have a cause that precedes it and that all causes must be before any measured effect in physics. Though this statement might seem sensible and completely unbreakable in its rules, Einstein imagined an entirely new understanding of causality that not only pokes holes into this theory, but provides researchers with the mechanisms to understand the nature of space-time itself and his theories on special and general relativity. Albert Einstein believed that if you draw out an X and Y graph and mark the X axis as space, with any movement to the left or right of the axis indicating distance, and mark the y-axis as time, with any movement up or down the axis indicating the future or the past, one could then get a far more comprehensive understanding of causality in the universe and how it could be broken. It was after the work in this light cone causality was finished that many began to truly understand how the rigid limits of causality did not truly exist and that action is merely limited by the cosmic speed limit of light. This then led to the theory that if one could travel faster than the speed of light, they could theoretically break causality and, in essence, travel through time itself. The Understanding of Space and Time Many of the greatest accomplishments surrounding that of Einstein's work was not actually that of the maths that he had developed with the help of his wife, but rather that of his understanding of the qualities of space and time and the addition of his work surrounding the existence of dimensions when talking about the nature of reality itself. In the realm of classical physics, many scientists had once believed that our universe, our very reality, was only existing in three discrete dimensions. These three dimensions allow solid objects to exist on three different planes, 
length, width, and height, and was believed to make up the entirety of space. The truth was, however, far stranger than what anyone had ever anticipated. Given the fact that three-dimensional space had the ability to warp and distort the very fabric of reality, Albert Einstein began to work on his theories of special and general relativity understanding that perhaps there was another dimension that had yet to be accounted for. It was during this work that Einstein would uncover the nature of gravity wells, the distortion of space, and how this can, in turn, distort the very passage of time itself. By understanding that the warping of space also correlated with that of the distortion of time, it became obvious to Einstein that space and time were one and the same, and that perhaps this unaccounted for extra dimension was that of time itself. By realizing that time and space were interwoven, Albert Einstein began to propose his theories of the fabric of space-time that understanding that both work in tandem to help form the nature of reality itself. The Fourth Dimension One of the most incredible discoveries made by Albert Einstein after better understanding the nature of space and time was that he began to realize that the fourth dimension itself was that of time. Though it might be hard to initially understand, Albert Einstein realized that time was that of an axis that three-dimensional space moves through. Human beings exist as three-dimensional beings, however, if we were to exist as fourth-dimensional beings, time would merely become a distance that one could theoretically travel to as all of space would merely represent one snapshot in time, similar to how a two-dimensional picture is just one snapshot of three-dimensional space. A good example to compare this to is how an MRI gathers three-dimensional information by taking a number of two-dimensional pictures and then layering them over each other. By treating the third-dimensional as merely snapshots of existence, it became obvious that the fourth-dimensional was time itself, as all objects move through time as a form of distance. By understanding that the fourth dimension itself is that of time, Albert Einstein was better able to understand the existence of timelines as a fourth form of axis and better understand the nature of causality itself. Today, scientists are still exploring these thoughts and, through the recent works of string theory and superstring theory, believe that our universe could hold more than 10 dimensions in total. Showing that Einstein's work in the revelation of the nature of space and time has had considerable impact in understanding the nature of reality itself. The Existence of Wormholes After proposing his theory of general relativity, Albert Einstein was confronted with new mathematical equations by that of Austrian physicist Ludwig Flamm, that began to realize that there had been another mathematical solution that was possible in Einstein's theory of general relativity that was a stark contrast to that of a black hole. Ludwig proposed that a theoretical time reversal of a black hole could exist that he referred to as a white hole and that entrances to both a black and white hole could be connected via a space-time conduit. Confronted with this new insight on his own work, Albert Einstein quickly began working alongside physicist Nathan Rosen to better understand the theories that had been proposed to him by Ludwig Flamm, and soon came to a startling new revelation that centered around the warping of space and time and that of his findings on the general theory of relativity. This new revelation was that of the formation of the wormhole theory that had originally been referred to as an Einstein-Rosen bridge. An Einstein-Rosen bridge was the working mathematical theory that centered around the existence of creating a bridge through space and time that could connect two different points in space-time and allow the passage between two different points, regardless of distance, instantaneously via a hole that punctures through a warped space-time itself. This meant that if one could open up a wormhole, they could travel across the universe faster than the speed of light and reach the opposing end without limit. The name for this Einstein-Rosen bridge would later be changed to that of a wormhole after Albert Einstein spent many attempts trying to explain the concept to others that were not well versed in the field. Albert Einstein would compare reality to that of an apple and that it was previously believed that the shortest points between each side of the apple was a straight line. However, if a worm could eat a hole through the apple, the new shortest path was that of the newly formed hole that connected the two points directly, thus coining the term wormhole for future scientists to use.
But what do you all think of these incredible scientific discoveries made by Albert Einstein during one of the peak breakthroughs in physics in the academic field that have left many people wondering the true nature of our impossible to understand universe and these strange discoveries? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.